What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video and today we're going to be going to the LA car show. Uh, this is my first time. This is actually the last day they're having at the LA Convention Center. Uh, usually runs for like two weeks but I'm super excited just because of the cars that's, that are going to be there. I'm um, going to try to test drive as much as I can. Uh, one thing I am super looking forward to is seeing the new Z. I've seen it a couple times but hopefully you know they um, let us sit in it. Also, if you guys know about the new C8 uh, ZL6, phenomenal car, and I can't wait to see that as well. I'm going to be going with a couple friends, so you guys get a little insight of everything, you know, that goes on in my life and stuff, whatever. But, um, yeah, I'm super excited, and then let's get to it. Oh damn, so this is the RCF F-Type and the only way I think I'm gonna, I'm, I'll get a Lexus if it's the track edition but you guys seen that, that thing's badass but damn this is real nice compared to like a Subaru interior it's completely better obviously because it's a Lexus but oh my god So personally, I've never been a huge fan of Corvettes up until the C8 came out and I'm about to go sit in one and this is going to be the first time and I'm super excited. It's the first time. First time. First time. Okay. 
Oh my god. Now this is what I'm talking about. You know, hopefully eventually we see one of these on the channel. But oh, this is my first time sitting on it and it's absolutely gorgeous. This is why I fell in love with the actual C8 and the, the models before it. Oh my god, this is a clap. This is just a supercar right now. American supercar, which is probably like the only American car I would ever get. So the display All right. How do you how do you get out? So if everything works out, then we're gonna be seeing one of these on the channel and we're gonna be doing a lot of great stuff with this. But just cross your fingers, everything goes good and then you guys will see it on there. WRX this is the first time and let's see how it is because I'm most likely not gonna get this I'm happy I got my STI when I did so we'll see how it feels oh my god uh, oh this is a cool display though I'm not gonna lie it's automatic though never get automatic anymore let's go Pyro. But, it feels like a WRX. The seats hug you a little bit more. The enter is a little bit nicer. Let's see. Does it uh it doesn't turn on, huh? Stop pressing the button the brake button. Press the brake button. No, we need the key, but I mean it's pretty cool. Dude, this is dope. Dude, it's a test drive. The, the new BRZ. So honestly, the Inter is a lot better than the one they have out right now. But I don't think I'd ever get a BRZ. I actually think this is pretty cool right here and how, the, how they have the gauges. But And then the seats are freaking awesome. They're better than the ones I have already. But I don't think I'd ever get one of these. Oh, and then they have the STI for where Travis Pastrana did the Gymkhana. Ooh, I've seen this already at a Subi Fest, so it's badass. All right, guys, so this is our 1500 Ram Rebel. To show some stability, we're gonna go up on our bank here. It's about a 20 to 25 degree angle. Jesus Christ. So about that wide wheelbase. Low oh, center of gravity key. Shit, I love this. <laughs> <laughs> Under the hood, 5.7 liter V8 Hemi motor. You get 395 for the horsepower. Awesome. 410 torque. 10 feet of torque. Eight God. speed automatic transmission. That is 25 awesome. degree angle up and down. Oh. Want to isolate the front view? Yeah. 
Ooh. Wow. How much does this one run for? Uh, start at 48 for the trim level. This exact one is about 62, 63. <laughs> <laughs> That's beautiful. Comfort features. This one's got heated, heated seats up front, heated steering wheel. Got a nice big. Uh, oh, you got the full panoramic sunroof. Yeah. 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 Blind spot one is on the mirrors, forward collision alerts, adaptive cruise control, perpendicular and parallel park assist. Nice big 12 inch display. You can it. use Apple CarPlay or Android Auto on your cell phone on it. If you do any towing, it's got towing brakes, uh, trailer steering. They do offer an air suspension on the Rebel. That's a unique shifter. Yeah, it's just pretty much just a, a knob. A knob, yeah. You want them to mistaken it for the volume, huh? Sometimes I'm kind of like, <laughs> I'm reaching for a column or like, yeah. I'm like the same thing with the volume and the shifter. Hey, does this thing run on Gabagool? I think so. It launches? And it's got spaghetti launchers? <laughs> no, it's the jellyfish launcher. Oh, it's marinara sauce. Mar mama mia, mama mia. Mar this actually runs on uh, goat. On what? On goat power. It runs off 10 goats. 10 goats? 10 goats. That's a lot, a lot of bad. That's, that. that's a lot of goats. A lot of bad. Yeah, GT500. Nice. Shut up, father. Just like my ex.
made it home back from the LA Auto Show and we did go get some food after so that was pretty delicious. Um, initial thoughts, it was pretty fun, you know, never been there like I said, this is my first time. Got to see like a few cars that I do want, hopefully in the future I get. So we'll see if that ends up working out and in the video I did mention that uh, there's a possible chance of some Z content of the new 400Z or whatever it's going to be called. So I'm super excited about that and hopefully everything works out and it should be on, on the channel. So um, got to sit on the, uh, inside the C8 and that was the first time ever and it feels fantastic. I see why everybody's be getting them. And uh, also the RCF, awesome car, looks phenomenal, super comfortable. I want one of those too. I think that'd be like a perfect daily. But other than that, I had a great time with friends, everything. Yeah, thanks for watching, and then I'll see you guys next time.